Hello all, this is Jacob Carter at Cottonclad Comics, and I was just writing to give some updates, somewhat major updates, for the channel and just the comics generally. So, first of all, uh, my apologies for not posting videos. I know that the audience isn't very big, but I said I would try and do that. Fortunately, unfortunately, work and other matters arose, which kind of deterred me on that, but I'm trying to get back into the habit of doing it. Uh, hopefully his work will slow down here. Real work, not this, but work, uh, <laughs> uh, pain work, sometimes pain work. It's slowed down and hopefully will allow me to uh, tackle these projects more fully. Um, dry, right as the weather is getting cooler, so I'm looking forward to that. But uh, first big announcement is that I have actually filed for Articles of Organization in the state of Alabama. I've reserved the name Crownless Kings. Or Crimeless King LLC. So any expenditures I have, whether I have to print anything or pay for anything, will now be done under that organizational name, which will be the umbrella organization for cotton-clad comics, fence, and other works. Now the second development is that I decided to jump the gun on the uh, newspaper or newsletter, which I had been discussing in a previous video, and the real impetus for that was that um, Matt Frad, who is a video blogger, somebody I, I kind of keep up with, he has a lot of good interviews, and I usually watch those, but I'm not, you know, I'm not a steady follower of his by any stretch of the imagination, but I saw that he was actually launching something identical to what I had conceived, except his is for more serious matters, cultural conversations, and the like. I just wanted to do comics. So it got me thinking, well, if he's doing it, I can do it, and I should do it quickly, since I had this idea floating around for a while. So I decided to jump the gun. I've been working on that, and I have the first 10 or 12 page little tabloid, small tabloid size newsletter drafted, and I should get that out to the printer later this week or early next week. Now I've reserved a P.O. box here in my county for that, so if you would like an issue, please feel free to write me. I'll include links which you can follow and, and write or email me and request a, um, an issue, and I'll be sure to get that out to you. Now another issue or another uh, development is that I've started posting literature, if you can call it that, scribbling's more like it, not real literature, to Wattpad. And Wattpad is an online platform which allows you to post series, chapters, and the like, either of an ongoing work or something which has been completed. And it allows you to interact with people, and people can comment and critique. It just gives you some um, visibility for your work, and hopefully can help you develop into a better writer. And I've opted to to do that with some an idea which I've had for a little while, but I've never really put pen to paper until recently, and I decided I'm going to give that a shot. So the general story is done. The chapters, of course, are not. Everything is subject to revision, but I thought it would be fun to put it on Wattpad and maybe get some feedback, hopefully, if anybody's interested in the topic. That is a children's fantasy, very lighthearted fantasy, not a novel, but a, a story which is called The Cotton Dragon, uh, which will be hopefully humorous and fun and lighthearted and the like. So please check that out. I'll, I'll put a description in the link as well. Or description in the link. Link in the description. That's the proper term. So you can check that out. But those are some pretty big developments on my end. The forming of the LLC, the launching of the Ink Rag, which is the tabloid newsletter, and then lastly, the posting of works on Wattpad. And hopefully we'll have some future developments on Incapade and then uh, other, other matters in the future regarding fence, which I'd like y'all to uh, take a gander at. And hopefully I can be putting out a lot more content and, you know, y'all will enjoy it. And, yeah, bring a little joy to my life. <laughs> yeah, because uh, nothing, nothing pleases more than when people enjoy something you produce. So... Please take a take a look at that, and I'll talk to y'all soon. Take care. God bless. Bye.